Hey everybody, welcome back to Guns and Gadgets. I really appreciate your time. Got a pretty cool holster to show you. This time it's for the Smith & Wesson Shield 9mm. Uh, this company, it's uh, Freedom Holsters. They uh, reached out to me and asked if I'd be interested in doing a review on their advanced inside the waistband holster. So I took them up on it and uh, I'm going to tell you what I think about it right now. Okay, so for me, if you watch my videos, you know I wear holsters for at least two weeks before I report back to you so that I can wear it in different climates. I can wear it with different clothing. I can wear it in different situations, different locations on my belt so that I could know if I like it or not because I'm not just going to tell you, hey, this thing's great if I don't like it. And uh, Freedom Holsters, I loved it. It's, uh, it's your basic holster, your basic inside the waistband holster. This one is uh, made of Bolteron. Uh, they do Kydex and Bolteron, depending on the style you choose. If you're not familiar with what Bolteron is, it's the same family of plastic that Kydex is made out of, but it holds up a little better in a uh, higher temperature. Just a little bit different uh, compound. But you, go, you guys know that retention is huge for inside the waistband holsters. You can adjust it how you want, but you don't want to be bending over and having your gun fall out you know, in, in church or wherever. You're in Home Depot bending to get something off the bottom shelf. You don't, you don't want to present... Your, uh, your firearm. But uh, this is right out of the box. I didn't make any adjustments on it uh, at all. Let's listen to this click. First off, the draw, it's, it's stiff. I mean, the, the retention on this is A+. Plus. Listen to the click. I mean, that is, like I said, right out of the box. This thing is like a mirror image of, of the firearm. The, the detail that is presented with the way they form the holster, it's, it's top notch. Now, I will tell you that these are handcrafted in the United States of America. What I can't tell you is how they make this holster. Uh, when, they, when I was going back and forth with them and doing research with the company, I was told that the process they use to make these is unlike any other holster making process out there. They said it was completely different and I tried to get some information on it and they said that it was so different they couldn't tell me because they didn't want other companies taking the idea. So it is handmade here in the U.S. with some special secret technique that makes it badass. Hmm. Okay, so let me show you some close-ups on this here so you can see the detail while I give you some of the facts on the company. And you can see that there's their clip with their logo right in it. Now, Freedom Holsters, they're here, made handmade here in the USA. They have a lifetime warranty. Uh, you can read the details of the warranty on the website, but if it's, uh, if, if for whatever reason there's a defect in the manufacturing, they, they, if they can't fix it, they'll replace it at no cost. You can find them on Facebook and Instagram. I'll have the links in uh, the description down here under the video. And they offer military and police discounts. So if you're out looking for a holster, you're going to say, listen, you know, uh, what makes this so different than any other holster that you've shown on your channel or any other one that's in my local gun shop? Well, a lot of them are made with the same materials, granted, whether it's Kydex or Bolteron or if you're into leather. And what the difference comes down to is the craftsmanship and how it's actually made and the fine details set them apart. On this holster, all the edges are sanded smooth. There's no sharp points. There's nothing, no hot spots that I could find when I wore it. Nothing that uh, uh, in and of itself made the holster uncomfortable to wear. It is made of uh, 0 0.08 inch thickness uh, Bolteron so that you do get uh, more durability. But here's the cool thing about this, options. I mean, what guy doesn't like options, whether it's your car or whatever, this holster has options. And that's what made it stick out for me, at least for uh, for my shield and the way I was testing it. I wore it three different ways because this uh, clip will adjust its cant, 15 degrees fore and aft, as well as uh, zero degrees if you're into the appendix draw. So I'll take a quick minute and show you how easy it is to adjust the cant. Okay, so I'll unscrew the clip here. We've got two screws holding it on. Okay, when you uh, remove the two screws and you pull the clip off, uh, this is what you're going to see. There are um, two rubber washers on there, so, you know, obviously pay attention when you're taking it apart. But you can see the, uh, the forward screw that is closer to the slide and the sights. There are three different holes that you can change. You can, the, uh, the screw here, you pop it out and pop it into one of these. And what that does is changes the cant of the firearm. You can wear it 15 degrees, zero, or minus 15 if you want to wear it like across on the opposite side of uh, body, body center uh, on your support side. 
pretty ingenious. It's good to have that option so that you can wear it in different spots of your body. Uh, because if you wear it every single day, all day long, you know that some types of clothing or some activities you're going to be doing, you might want to move that gun around uh, so that it doesn't A, present uh, or B, print or C, just be in an uncomfortable spot. So you have, you have options on where you're going to wear it. One of the biggest parts about a holster is making sure it's comfortable enough that you'll actually wear it. And uh, like I said, I wore this for I don't know, two and a half, that's almost three weeks that I wore it before filming the video here. And honestly, I haven't been wearing my shield for a while because I'm a Glock guy and I love, I just love my Glocks. I carried them for a living. But uh, I've been wearing my shield regularly now because of this holster. So uh, it works, it's comfortable, it's functional, it's extremely well made. The retention is off the charts. Uh, this, they make all kinds of styles uh, and colors. Check out their website. It's freedomholstersllc.com. You can see it here on the screen. It'll also be in the description. I'll also tell you they make outside the waistband holsters. They also make a combo holster, which is both an inside the waistband and an outside the waistband holster. Check that out. That's pretty cool. And they also make what they call a freedom fit. It's uh, one holster that will fit multiple firearms. Check that out. It's pretty cool too. Some other things that should be on your list about uh, checking on a holster before you purchase it. Uh, as you can see, uh, you might have seen it as I've been flipping around. It does have a full sweat shield so that it, you're not going to get those uh, blood blisters from pinching yourself if you have a, a tactical muffin top or if you're you know, bent over when you're holstering and, and trying different positions when you're, when you're actually out there shooting and practicing. Uh, so that, that's a big help. Also, one thing to look at when you're purchasing a holster is the retention. Out of the box, this thing is formed to the gun. It's, it fits like a glove. But if you want a tighter draw or a looser draw, this, these two screws here by the, uh, the front of the trigger guard and underneath the barrel, this is what they call their enhanced retention mechanism. Two screws here, you can tighten the screw to make the holster grip tighter, making it a, a, a more of a retention uh, beast. And then you can loosen them as well if you want more of a smoother, uh, if you want more of a smooth draw. So check them out. Again, the links are all in the description. It's freedomholstersllc.com. I'll have the links to their uh, website as well as their social media down below. So if you want to reach out to them, uh, they've been re very responsive anytime I've talked to them. And I have no reason to believe they wouldn't do the same to you if you're going to order. Check them out. If you're in the market, they make good stuff. Free shipping on all the orders as well. So you can't beat that with a stick. Take care, guys. This is Jared from Guns and Gadgets. Until the next time, be safe, stay vigilant, and carry a weapon. Take care.